Yes, you hear this, folks. All this, within a few months, will be gone. All this. Google, which people don't know, owns YouTube, okay? Google owns YouTube. So, of course, we got to blame the people who own YouTube. Google. Because Google bought YouTube, and basically, if Google owns YouTube, they are basically responsible for all of YouTube, what YouTube does, and all that stuff. And for the longest time, Google has done nothing but make YouTube worse, like trying to force Google Plus down people's throats, adding the stupid bell because they don't want because because Google is too lazy, lazy to move to put notifications for subscribe channels, but then there are channels that do make a lot of videos. So Google does. So that's actually the bell button is kind of understandable if you sub to a channel, they upload like 50 videos a day, like I, sometimes I do, but. YouTube is now when we read a sub count. Yes. Why? Because this is Crown World. These dumb companies can do whatever they want. And <clears throat> that's the problem. Our government should sort of break up YouTube from Google because we have a war against monopolies. Google owns all sorts and all video making. Okay. Google does not allow any competition, or else the mainstream media will call them like bad or something. We need an alternative of the YouTube, but but the thing is, YouTube does not care, or Google, which owns YouTube. So why why the hell is the sub count being removed? That's the thing. It's the most pointless thing YouTube has ever done. In terms of updates, removing the sub count is the stupidest thing, most pointless thing. Why would you remove the sub count instead of addressing problems with YouTubers? Why? It's because YouTube only cares about companies. YouTube is just now another corporate thing where only companies can do well. Um, Twitter used to be the same thing as well. It used to be like ruled by people just selling their emotions. And then the celebrities took over Twitter, they took over Instagram. And companies and celebrities took over Instagram because, of course, we, us normal everyday folks don't get any followers. And YouTube was the last place where um, normal people can become celebrities. But now, it's all these stupid companies like T-Series, 5-Minute Crafts, and various others as well. But YouTube has been going downhill for a long time. Um, they have been going down long hill, downhill. Um... Like, the sub bell can actually be justified a little bit, like, if it's not, like, if you sub to a channel that uploads, like, what to say, like, watch Mojo, and they upload, like, five videos a day, um, you don't have all the time in the world, or, 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 or if you just sub to, like, um, CNN, and because CNN's a news source, they can upload constantly, or Marvel, or a company, that's, but then... So it actually can't make sense the bell exists. Okay, that's a justifiable reason. But removing the sub count, there's no reason to remove it. There's, the only reason why they want to remove it is because they want to make YouTube worse. They want to remove, uh, telling you, oh, like, they want to remove Social Blade, um, which uses YouTube and stuff, and they're removing it all together. And they always have done, um, when you look at a YouTube account, it always says, like, 5k, let's talk a PewDiePie, it says like 90 million, 95 million, T-Series 99 million. But now you won't even be able to know how many subscribers you really have. So, they want to use your analytics, which, you can't go on analytics and sort up T-Series, you can't. You can't look it up for PewDiePie, so it's absolutely pointless to remove this. As a lot of people want to know, the live sub count of popular YouTubers. So, yes, YouTube is going downhill again. And everybody is mad. Um, while small channels and while people who don't use YouTube probably don't care. But while people who watch PewDiePie for the T-Series do care. While people who care about the subscriber counts do care. A lot of people do care. And there's only like a small minority like companies that don't care how many subscribers they have. Because they're companies. They only do stuff for corporate means. So YouTube is... We just need something... To basically just take over YouTube um, as a video selling website and that's basically it. Goodbye.